Hey, before you do your buckle, before you do your alpha belt buckle, I want you just to have, have your Go. alpha belt through your blouse and just have it hanging there, you understand? Yes, yes. I will give you your alpha belt loop, you understand that? Awesome. Awesome. Yes, the way it's conducted is the, the, the recruits spend as much time as possible getting their uniforms and the squad bay and everything uh, cleaned and ready and pressed and all that. On game days, all the drill instructors, the third hats, whatever, get together. They go around there with what's called the detail inspectors. They go through and they do all the, the fine nitpicking questions and whatnot. Virginia, sir. Yes, sir. Come on, sir. Virginia, sir. Come on, sir. Come on, sir. Come on, sir. Come on, sir. Yes, sir. This is right with Sarah Lemon. 10, 28, 12, 16, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I guess we didn't clean our weapon, did we? Yes, sir. Awesome. We didn't take the parts out to make sure our weapon was clean, right? No, sir. Disgusting thing. Awesome. 18, sir. Just crap away from Yes, sir. Awesome. Yes, sir. See, sir. Really? Really? Yes. Now, sir, not holding out of the weapon, right? No, sir. Let go! Awesome. Okay, I know you crap the small as fuck. Sir, it's five. Five, five, zero. Five, 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 five,
and uh, emotionally too. Get to the wall. Oh, oh, get to the wall. Oh, With all the the haze that the drill instructors try to create and make it as realistic as possible uh, by us putting a lot of stress on the recruits, I think for them it's it's exhausting. He's bleeding. Take him to the torment. Get him out of the kitchen. Get him out. Get him out. Get him out of the kitchen. The drill instructors create an environment for them to feel a, a, a sense of urgency, to feel pressure, to feel stressed, and I think that's what makes the training even that much better. The night movement course is pretty. It's very similar to the day movement course. Uh, however, it's a it's a more tactical it's a more tactical environment. They have to maintain silence. Uh, in the daytime, there's a lot of yelling, there's a lot of screaming, there's a lot of movement on the fire. At night, they're strictly the focus is to strictly be on uh, re being as tactical and as silent as fo as possible in order to be a successful move to the course. Get the casualty out of freaking them trash right now. Get him up. Get the, get the casualty out of kills her. Get me out of here! Help! Help! Get me out of here! Help! Help! Uh, at this stage or this phase in recruit training, um, they're at a mature uh, at a mature state, a mature phase. Uh, they've they've pretty much grown. Right now, they're in phase three. It's, a, it's an observation phase where we get to see what we, what all the all the training that they've done throughout recruit training. We get to see the the, the outcome of it. Uh, it involves a lot of field training. It involves a lot of them doing things more on their own. My impression of them is that they've definitely come a long way. Uh, they are a younger group. They're a little bit more immature than the groups that we get in the winter. But I mean, that will come a time. You can tell the difference between when they got here and now, and, and how they respond and how they act and whatnot. They have a, you know, a better understanding of how the Marine Corps works now. As drill instructors, we've seen them grow. We've seen them work well together. They're starting to work in fire teams. They, work, they know, understand what a fire team is. They understand that they need to know the recruit to the left and the right of them, as Marines do to the left and the right. Um, they get the concept of, of working together in buddy pairs. They get that teamwork concept, and it ties into to them uh, accomplishing the mission. Hey, where's my fire road guard? From last time. Keep it tight. I said run, guys. The training objective of BWT is just to get them a starter into, you know, in the low crawls and the movement under fire and whatnot. The primary objective of the crucible is okay, now you're gonna do all these missions, but now you have lack of food and lack of sleep. It's a 54 hour mission and they get a total of between the two nights only four hours of sleep. Chow is on you, do we understand that? Yes, sir! Chow, water, everything is on you, do we understand that? Chow, son! Chow, son! Chow, son! Chow, son! Chow, son! Chow, son! Yeah! 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 Yeah!